son. Good job, buddy. All right, so this is what Van Gogh had created. Came out beautiful. This one-eared rescue dog named Van Gogh is a painter, just like the artist he's named after. So I had seen Van Gogh's picture, and it was an instant love at first sight. He was just absolutely adorable. Um, I fell in love with his big smile and his name and his story. He was actually a friendly neighborhood stray, and some dog fighters had picked him up and used him as a bait dog. So he was actually found um, hiding in a drain pipe, covered in you know scrapes, and his ear unfortunately was hanging off. So he was brought in by animal control to the shelter, and unfortunately with the injuries, he did have to have his ear amputated. No one seemed to want to adopt the seven-year-old boxer pit bull, so Jacqueline Gartner got an idea, letting him paint. I thought it'd be a cute little gift to give to the potential adopter, and he, we learned, loved peanut butter. We did an art gallery event, and he had made canvases, and we had auctioned them off to do a fundraiser as well as try to help him find a home. And I ended up getting commission offers from people that wanted to buy his art. So the whole idea completely took off. So how exactly are his creations made? We essentially are putting a thin layer of peanut butter on top and he just licks the peanut butter. While he's licking the peanut butter, all the paint is moving around within the bag. So that's kind of how it works. Right, Van Gogh. Money raised for Van Gogh's painting goes back to Jacqueline's animal rescue and it helps other dogs find homes. To date, we've raised $3,500 for Happily Forever After Rescue. His skills have made Van Gogh a big deal. His most requested piece has definitely been Starry Night, and I think just because of Van Gogh, that is his most famous painting. Can you play with me? You want to play? It also finally got him yeah. adopted. And as soon as I walked in the door, I fell in love with that face. Um, he barked at me a little bit, and then I just sat on the floor, and he kept coming up to me, and. Just, you just had a connection with him. Jessica says Van Gogh will continue to paint, but only for a good cause. Yes, but it'd only be for Jacqueline and for her rescue. So any profits that would go would be directly to her. Having such support from all over the world, working with Jacqueline and the Fosters and the team, and it's amazing. This is Inside Edition Digital.